Good Thursday morning, everyone. Meteorologist Stone Schaefer here with your July 25th morning one-minute forecast. Starting off on weather alerts, you have this heat advisory up until 9 p.m. Central Daylight Time and excessive heat warning up until 9 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. Temperatures and heat indexes being around 100 to 110 degrees. It's going to be a warm one. Drink that water as you head out and about. And we look at another warning we have. We do have a fire weather warning uh, down to the southwest into eastern Montana up until 9 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. With that, uh, just a little bit drier out there to the west. They also have a drought, so it's uh, the ground's a little bit drier already. A uh, wind's a little bit heavier. With a fire does start, could spread pretty easily. Uh, air quality index does show we've gotten to the moderate across much of the state, but there has been sort of a big change when it comes to those smoke uh, smoke forecast models. Uh, this morning, we do have a cold front that's expected to roll through late tonight into tomorrow morning. Uh, it was showing that it was going to sort of clear us out, but now it looks like uh, that smoke may end up billowing behind that cold front as it rolls through with that low pressure system, and it could give us some pretty heavy smoke by the end of the day Friday into Saturday morning. So we'll keep an eye on it. There could be another wave that's rolling in out there from Canada and the western portions of the state. So uh, winds aloft are all from the northwest, even though our surface winds might be from the south, that sort of northwest wind that we're seeing up through the atmosphere is bringing in more wildfire smoke possibly. Temperatures are showing upper 70s to the 90s already, 97 in Beach, Bowman, uh, to that southwest corner in our highs. Well, they're going to be even warmer, lower 90s to the triple digits all across the state sydney at 108 you got beach and bowman 107 and 106 minot at 100 and bismarck at 99 spc has given us a severe weather risk up there into northeast montana we'll see how that develops we look at precision cast and what we see is we do have some chances of showers and thunderstorms developing uh, late into the afternoon into the evening uh, the big question is how far east uh, does that severe weather chance maybe move in? Uh, be prepared for some hail, maybe some heavy winds. Uh, then Friday afternoon, another chance of isolated showers and thunderstorms. Doesn't look to be anything severe. Then Saturday, do have some rain chances popping up out east. Uh, and there's a signal of severe weather for Saturday as well. So the KX Storm Team will be keeping an eye on that. Uh, make sure you tune into KX News at noon. Where I'll be going over more about your weather.